I've been out talking about the minimum wage and the, the need for that, uh, how it's a good business practice. Uh, I was a bus in business and business owner and, and uh, fair treatment of employees is really important for a successful business, but it's also good for Pennsylvania. Uh, we increase the minimum wage, we not only increase the compensation for workers, we increase the consumption dollars for people uh, who can now buy things in our stores and restaurants. So it's a really important thing for all Pennsylvania. We are, I think, one of a handful of states that have not raised the minimum wage above uh, the federal level. Uh, I think 29 other states have already done this, including all the states around us. So it's time for us to do this. It's not just the businesses I visited uh, this week, but Walmart is doing it, Aetna Insurance is doing it. So many companies are, are, are doing this and, and finding that it's not only the right thing to do, it's a smart thing to do. My government reform is, is uh, aimed at trying to create that kind of government that deserves the trust that people of Pennsylvania need to have in, in their democratic system. So I have five things I'm trying to do uh, from gift ban to outside employment to uh, pay for play, want to eliminate that, uh, to lobbying disclosure, uh, and also campaign finance reform. Drexel, MIT, and Cornell University have gotten a $75 million grant from the Federal Department of Defense uh, for a new type of fiber, uh, and I think all of us in Pennsylvania should be proud of the innovative, smart people, talented people at Drexel University in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, who are part of this uh, consortium. How was the Easter egg roll? Easter egg roll was a ball. I really loved the bunnies.